Okay, my young budding potential importers, I'm sure you're chomping at the bit to get started. I thought first though, I'd go through a few of the requirements. Um, they're not set in concrete, um, and it also answers a few questions as to what you might be thinking and what you're letting yourself in for. Um, importing is a lot of work and it's not for everyone. So we'll kind of go through these things. Um, that way then, if you go halfway through this course and go, oh, you know, I don't really think this is for me, then, you know, I told you so, okay? <laughs> well, you should be cool. All right, let's go. Okay, how much to get started? I'm gonna say about $500, um, not a great deal of money. Uh, save your pennies, um, sell some stuff in your house, uh, probably best to sell some stuff in your house, get you selling, get you, get you getting products up online or getting people around your house buying stuff. Getting at five hundred dollars together is, you know, probably what you need. Um, in all honesty, you don't need it all at once, so you don't need to have five hundred dollars before you can start doing this course. Um, but I'd say initially your cost will be there or thereabouts over the course of however long it takes for you to get started. Um, it's very fluid. Um, you know, this case for all different people of all different starts. You know, starting budgets, um, I'm, I'm not going to say, oh, you have to have this at this time. We have to get this done at this time. Um, you know, you can go at your own pace. There's no there's no rush to this. There's no, oh, I have to have $500. Um, you can have what you need to get started. The costs will present themselves, and they just need to be covered as and when they do. Okay. People have done it with less. People have done it with nothing. Okay. Um, you'll be going to be talking to suppliers in China. Uh, negotiating with these guys. If you get a sniff that you can get away with getting something for free, um, then go for it. We'll be going into ways that you can do this later in the course, um, so hold on for that one. Okay, a reality check. This course is a lot of work and takes creativity and determination. You are going to get stuck and more than likely get frustrated about being stuck, okay? That is cool, all right? The biggest part of that is that, uh, yeah, you're gonna get stuck. Yeah, you're gonna get annoyed about being stuck, or yeah, you're not gonna know what to do, but the biggest part of that is pushing forward and smashing through that barrier, okay? Don't just go, oh, it's not for me, I can't do it, I, you know, this isn't working, or, you know, this supplier's messed me around, or these guys haven't delivered this, or I've been ripped off, which is very unlikely, by the way, but it does happen, whatever. All knockbacks, all setbacks, the only person that you can blame if you don't succeed is you, okay? So you keep pushing forward, you have me, and you can speak to me whenever you like in the Udemy, uh, in the Udemy question area. Um, a growing community of importers, um, there is a blog and uh, a Facebook group being constructed as we speak, so there'll be fur further places that you can go. So believe me, you can do this, you've got this, but you have to keep going forward determination, creativity, uh, sprinklings of tenacity, but yeah, you need to keep going. Okay, you are learning a skill. Okay, this isn't a money-making method. Um, this isn't something that, uh, oh, if I do follow these step-by-step -step, uh, uh, parts or parts of this guide, I'm going to learn how to do this, okay? This is a job, a career, a business. Um, it's way bigger than that. It's not like a little guide you pick up off a warrior forum or something like that. Um, this is something that is constantly evolving. You're gonna be using uh, Alibaba, Amazon, eBay, Craigslist, Etsy. These are some of the biggest, of most evolving and fastest changing uh, websites and marketplaces in the world. And uh, your role as an importer will change and will need to adapt as these changes happen, which is regularly. Um, you will constantly be learning for your entire time as an importer. And that is a great thing. Um, it's a great thing because it always keeps interesting. It always keeps this job and this career fresh. You're always learning new things. And not just learning stuff that's generic and boring. You're learning cool new importing techniques, ways to get things done, new marketing techniques um, with people who are really great people. I mean, a community of importers on the internet who use Amazon and who use FBA, they're really nice and they're really funny people. So it's, it's just great. It's a great community and a great place to be working in. Okay, potential growth. There is no limit to the potential growth you can take this. Absolutely none. 
With Amazon and correct product research, you can be selling in many different countries in a very short space of time. Once you're making money, you can progress onto branding, physical shops, product creation, or just sell up. You know, hey, I've made my business, it's worth this much money, I'm going to the Maldives, okay? I'm gonna sell this thing, I'm out of it. I don't blame you, <laughs> good luck with that one. If you do do that, send me a postcard. <laughs> um, yeah, you can do all those things. Uh, Amazon is making it very easy for you to literally just move your products from warehouse to warehouse um, all over the world and just sell through Amazon and truly be an international company with great ease. And we'll be going into that towards the end of the course. Um, or you've got a long way to go before then. You really need to get those products selling first. But once you get to those sort of stages, it becomes very easy to escalate into a big company very quickly. Okay, the lifestyle. This can be as hands-on as you want it to be. In the beginning, you will have to work very hard. But once you're up and running, your business can be run from a laptop anywhere in the world. Seriously, um, you don't even have to touch your products. You can get your samples in. You will have to touch them and keep them somewhere safe. But uh, you're not going to have, or at the end of it, you're not going to have uh, a house full of boxes or you know swamped with product. You can literally get your products taken straight to uh, warehouses and fulfill fulfillment centers. Easy for you to say, and uh, they'll be distributing for you. So it's not like it's uh, staff and oh god, you know, forklift trucks or anything like that. It can be if you want it to be, and literally is, as I said, hands on as you want it to be. The more you work at this, the bigger this business is going to be. Um, but if you want to just get a residual income coming in, a nice couple of thousand a month, and uh, sit on a beach somewhere with your your iMac, then great, fair play to you, and it's that's totally feasible to do. Okay, the conclusion is. Minimum startup cash required. Like I say, it's five hundred dollars. Um, that's a, a guesstimate. It varies from person to person, or for the products that you are looking to import in. I mean, some products obviously cost more than others. I, I don't know what you're going to be doing, but you know, I, I'd say roughly around five hundred dollars. Um, but that's not all at once. You can uh, take those costs as and when they come. Uh, this is not a get rich quick scheme. This is a job. It's a business. It's a career. It's to a certain extent, a way of life. It's addictive, it's exciting, and it's a lot of fun. Um, it's a lot of work, but the rewards are truly amazing. Um, you're gonna make a lot of money. If you do this right, you can make serious, serious money. Um, I'm talking millions. Uh, there, there is no limit to how much you can make. Um, and at the bottom there, it can change your life, and it can change your life, and once you start getting a bug, it more than likely will. So uh, yeah, that's just uh, kind of like the requirements, couple of reality checks there. Um, hope you like what you got saw there and uh, you're still nodding your head like, yep, well, let's get going. <laughs> if you are, then I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.